So Mark, let me get started. Um, just want to start asking you about what CRM is and give our students an introduction as to what it is and what Salesforce role in this industry. Sure. So uh, CRM acronym stands for uh, Customer Relationship Management. It's pretty common in the industry. I think from back in the ages, uh, businesses try to, uh, to manage the life cycle of the customer. Mm -hmm. And uh, really at the core of Salesforce is how do we put the customer at the center for uh, businesses and to be able to track them all the way through their life cycle. So Salesforce was a pioneer in the cloud platforms mm -hmm. and uh, their first offering or first initial offering was a customer relationship management system. And right. so customers would enter in customer information and then be able to manage that. Now, obviously that's evolved into a much larger practice and a much larger platform. Mm -hmm. But I think at the core, it truly is uh, how, how to, as a business, how do I connect and then manage my customer relationships throughout the life cycle. Basically, in the marketing class that I teach, we always try to distinguish between the B2B world where businesses are selling to other businesses versus the B2C world where businesses are selling to millions, if not you know, more of customers. And so I'm curious to find out from you, Mark, how do B2B commerce how do those customers make use of CRM? And then what's different about, you know, going to direct to consumer? Because you mentioned the Live Nation where there's three parts of businesses, right? So there's some B2B there, there's some B2C. So first let's distinguish, and then maybe you can talk about how some companies are trying to manage both. Sure, so direct to consumer or B2C is, um, definitely unique mm -hmm. and different than uh, marketing to a, another business. Mm -hmm. in, in a sense, when you're marketing to a customer, you're typically presenting features and capabilities of your product and, and or your service. Mm -hmm. And um, in that, that changes the whole dynamic of how you're trying to establish and build your relationship. So your messaging, your marketing mix, your, um, your uh, way of uh, identifying who your your potential customers are and then attracting them all are unique in that again you're presenting your product or service mm -hmm. directly to them as you probably described in your class for b2b it's all about enablement mm -hmm. it's all about value in how do you enable that business to be able to connect with their customers so there's almost like a second ring in there so crm changes uh, quite a bit in that, again, what would typically be a customer 360 inside a CRM system mm -hmm. or a B2C, it's different attributes. It's who am I as a person? What mm -hmm. am I excited about? What am I interested in as far as what you're marketing to me for? And so that customer data, that customer information totally changes. The other components kind of fall suit. So for your marketing departments, their positioning and creating marketing material and messaging that kind of caters to features, capabilities of your product, and of course, what's exciting about that. For B two B, that all changes, right? Because now you're just you're an you're an enabler. Um, so my customer information is really more business elements. Mm. Um, wh what it is that helps them attract their customers. Mm. So the data inside a B2B and how you market inside a B2B is totally different um, in that it houses probably financial information, mm -hmm. business goals and objectives. Mm -hmm. It probably houses the, the mission statement that the CEO has created. Mm -hmm. It probably has a whole breakdown of what their customer demographics would be so that you can organize that. And then their marketing department would also, and how they message is also different too. Mm -hmm. So, so going to B2B, you're, again, not marketing a product, you're marketing a value statement right. aligned to that. So completely different um, in how you manage both of those. And then obviously that changes the orientation of a customer relationship management system too in an automation platform. 